does play world, let me share with you the joy that is a rotary cutter. Now, if you're using a traditional pair of sewing scissors, you have to make a cut, pick up the scissors, and move to the next section of the cut and proceed to finish it. And this can end with uneven edges. Now, this is fine if you don't have exposed pieces or if the seam allowance is okay with that and you can hide it in the inside. But if you want nice, clean, even lines of the entirety of the cut, a rotary cutter is amazing for this. And it wasn't until I got a hold of a good one and actually a good blade that I was made fully aware of this. And the idea here is to evenly apply pressure over the material you're cutting through and hopefully get it done in one swipe, leaving you with one continuous even line, which is amazing! Now, the main thing for me about a rotary cutter is I use heavier materials like vinyl and leather and this can dull the blade a bit more quickly. And if you've ever been to a fabric store, you'll know the blades are not exactly cheap. So I highly recommend getting a sharpening tool because um, where it might not dull as quickly for others as it did for me, um, I definitely didn't want to spend upwards of $50 in, t in blades for a single project. So it's definitely advised that you get a sharpener because it will extend the life of that blade. Additionally, remember to keep it oiled, and because it is reasonably sharp, uh, do keep it in the locked position when not in use. Uh, it can rest on things and stuff happens. I hope this helps you. Good times to all. If you like cosplay, hit that sub button, because boy do I have videos for you.